In this Python NiceGUI tutorial, we will make two examples of separator and splitter. I will show step by step in the video how to do both applications. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. I will use these images in applications. You can download these images from GitHub in the description section of the video. I will add the Python image to the web page. I am sending the Python image to the image function. I adjust the size of the image using the classes function. I save the code file and run it. You can go to this address using any browser. I added the image to the website. I will add another image. But first, let's learn how to use the separator element. I add the separator function right after the image. I added the separator object to the web page. Let's add another image right after the separator object. I am sending the JavaScript image to the image function. I adjust the size of the image using the classes function. I am saving the code file. I added the JavaScript image to the web page. Now let's make an example to learn how we can use the splitter object. I add the splitter function using with. I set the size of the object using the classes function. I will code which objects will be before and after the splitter object. I want to have a Python image beforehand. I send the Python file to the image function and set its size. I am saving the code file. I added the splitter and visual object to the web page. Now I will code which objects will be in the splitter after. I add the JavaScript image to the web page and adjust its size. I am saving the code file. I added the two images and the splitter object to the web page. Now I will add a simple label object to the before and after codes. I am sending the text suitable for the label functions. I am saving the code file. I added the label objects. In this video, we learned how to use splitter and separator objects. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.